Hey there, this is the 11th video of the 40 day raw potato and water diet challenge. I've got another shirt, one of my Kmart shirts that when I moved back here to where in West Virginia back in 14 from Western Kentucky, I wore this shirt a lot. And I have to say that there was a, a six months, a year ago, that I, I couldn't put this shirt on at all. But this is what I look like today, August 29th. And uh, let's get started and cut up a tater. Yesterday, I kind of figured out a way I like cutting the potatoes up when I was making my video. So if I just make a, uh, and I sharpen my knife, make a flat spot right there, and then slice it up real thin. The thinner the better. When you're trying to eat these raw potatoes, you want them as, I can't cut them as thin as a potato chip, but you can cut them thin. And I also noticed that if your knife is sharp, that really helps. And not going quite all the way through. Okay, so what I've ended up with, I got a flat spot right here. And this whole potato is basically sliced up into a little thin. And it's got little hinges right here on the end. Now, I'm going to try to cut this just as thin as I did the first slices I was making. And what this is going to make is little bitty pieces of long potato. And that's the easiest way to eat this. And if you haven't been, if this is your first time watching this video, these videos, I don't, I only like eating the red potatoes. Yellow Yukons are okay, but the red potatoes is where it's at. Russet potatoes suck really bad. So check this out. This is beautiful. I mean, just beautiful. Now I've ended up with these little bitty, these little bitty fine squares of, and it's just so easy to chew up and eat this way because Taters aren't that easy to chew up, and they're not hard to chew up, but, and for the next week, I'm eating six taters a day, so, I mean, I'm eating three taters a day for a whole week, one for each meal, and, uh, and I just started that yesterday, so that's going to be about a red potato I looked up today. A medium sized one has almost 200 calories or so in it. So we're only talking about eating like 600 calories a day, which that's not really going to hurt me. The skin has a lot of protein in it. So you want to eat the skin. I'm eating the skin. So All right, I'm going to slice up that heel I cut off of there and get this going. Yesterday kind of sucked because for some reason I was up almost three and a half pounds from the day before. And this is the 10th day on the diet and 11th video. And uh, so, but I did drink a lot of water and uh, you know what, I ate, ate a lot of potatoes, I was hungry. So that's the way it goes, you know, sometimes it's gonna, you never know, I'm gonna hang in there. I'm gonna hang in there with this challenge for 40 days no matter what happens. And what's gonna be really neat about this is it's gonna, Look at that. And that gives you a, a lot of something that, like for me, if I eat these one piece at a time, it's going to give me something to do for a while, you know. So I'm going to put some uh, organic apple cider vinegar on there. My seasonings. got from the Dollar Tree. I still haven't looked up how much sodium intake I'm supposed to have. I know that has some salt in it. 
I do know I need a certain amount of salt every day. There we go, put a little Parmesan cheese on there. This guy have a little bit of flavoring, you know, that was probably like a teaspoonful or whatever. And then for some fat, I'm gonna put a little bit of extra virgin olive oil on. <coughs> Excuse me. I had some potato go down in my lungs and I had to cough it out. We're all good now. All right, so this is the time of the day I'm actually really hungry. I did try doing this at noon. But I get up at midnight and go to work and I get off about midnight. I mean, you know, at noon during the day. So, like I took two potatoes in a Ziploc bags with me and to work and I just chew on them all day. I just, like, I like to eat when I drive. So I just, you know, I just open a bag up and eat a piece while I'm driving. So it kind of passes the time. And that's really how I gained all this weight. Because when I moved up here in 2014, I I weigh I only weighed like I mean it was still a lot, but I weighed like 330 pounds. So I think at one time I was up to 440, maybe five 450 pounds when I quit eating sugar back at the first of June. So uh, you know I gained a lot of weight riding driving my semi. And, and just eating food while I drive. That's what I like to do is eat while I'm driving. And I'm still eating while I'm driving right now. I'm just eating raw potatoes. And uh, and that's the way to cut them up. That's what it looks like with the... As you can see some seasoning and stuff on there. It makes it really easy to eat. And this is the way to do it. It's pretty good. All right. Let's go over, weigh up, and see what's going on today. You know, like I said yesterday, I was up, you know, like three. Hey there, there's me face. I was up yesterday, uh, 3.4 pounds, and yesterday I weighed 413.2. There we go. That was yesterday's weight, the 28th. I was 413.2 plus 3.4 pounds. But I started out at 421.8, so I was still down 9.6 pounds yesterday. And I had a blood pressure reading yesterday of 145 over 82. If you wanna see all the uh, supplements I'm taking via uh, Dr. Frida off of YouTube, her suggestions I just watched her channel and uh, that's a good channel to watch if you're overweight so let's see what kind of weight we got right here right now Four twelve point two. so 412 point two I'm down a pound from yesterday, August 29th, and I ate three potatoes yesterday and today. I'll just put it on that line. You can see I got a big grid here. And I, I drew this out. This is just a piece of foam from the Dollar Tree that cost a dollar. So I'm going all the way down here to 40, 41. So we got, uh, you know, we got 29 days to go. Matter of fact, it's probably going to be 41 days because on Tuesday afternoon, which will be some around this day, which will be some around September uh, 28th or whatever, I'm going to, over to Abdallah Steakhouse in Empire, Ohio. And the first thing I'm going to eat is a French fry. <laughs> That's the first thing I'm going to put in my mouth. And then after that, I'm going to go on like a 14-day prison diet my buddy jimmy thought it would be cool before i started this potato diet i was telling him about it he was like you ought to just do a prison diet you know water and and uh and uh bread all right we got 14 we got four we got 412 
6.2 two times in a row. We know that's a pretty accurate reading. All right, we're going back to my face. We're back at my face. All right, everybody. This has been a real interesting challenge. So I was up 3.4 from yesterday, but now I'm down a whole nother pound today. So, uh, you know, I, and I really haven't exercised because, well, I did exercise. I mowed the yard. But it's in the 90s and it's so muggy and I'm so, I just really don't like the heat. And that's why I'm not out riding my bicycle this afternoon or anything. It's going to cool down in a couple of days. So when I get back out riding and stuff, this should, hopefully this is going to pick up. So I appreciate everybody. My buddy, my two best friends in the whole world are Gary and Tim. And Tim from Versailles, Kentucky found my YouTube videos all on his own. Sent me a real nice message today, and buddy, I appreciate I've appreciated you from the moment we become friends. Like back in, I guess it was 1994, that day I met you in Lake City, and you showed up, and we started talking, been friends ever since. Thank you, buddy, and we'll talk to y'all tomorrow.